Hi, welcome to SolidWorks 2023 video tutorial. Another one of my basic part design exercises, a simple rod. I've made a drawing, so let's take a look at the drawing. Here it is, and you could make a screenshot and then follow this exercise step by step if you want. So, let's have fun with SolidWorks. Ok, let's start with a sketch on the front plane. I will need two rectangles, one, two. And let's go for a dimension here, this should be 20. This might be 80. That distance here could be 45, this distance should be 17.5 and that one here should be 80. Let's drag this inside and I need it to be aligned. Not coincident, but I want it to be horizontal. Let's try it again. Yes. And then this point here, that midpoint aligned with that one here, also horizontal. Now let's go for a trim. I want to trim this here. And I want to add a point right on that line. And the distance between this point and that line should be 15. Leave that sketch. Let's make a symmetric extrude. So go for features, go for extruded boss space, go for mid plane, and the distance should be 80. And confirm. Let's show that sketch. I need two fillets or rounds. So go for fillet, make it 15 millimeter on this edge and that edge. Confirm. And now I want to make a hole right there. So go for the hole wizard. It should be one which goes through all, yes, and the diameter should be. 12, go for positions and it should be right on that point. Confirm and OK. Hide that sketch here and I want to mirror it and see if we can do with the mirror, it should be possible we could do also a circular pattern, but I want to go for mirror and I want to mirror a body, this body here, and the mirror face plane would be the YZ plane, and that should be the right plane in this case. Yes. And I don't want to merge the solids, so let's confirm. And then I want to move that solid here. Now in order to rotate that solid, you need the move copy bodies command, which you could find here, insert, features, and there you go. OK, let's go for move copy bodies. I don't want to have a copy, I just want to rotate 
this one here and around the x-axis yes and that should be 90 degrees and confirm now I want to combine those two bodies so I want to combine this one with that one show the preview and confirm great now I need another sketch and that sketch would be on I think the right plane yes I need a polygon so where are my polygons there you go and it should be a six-sided one yes do it like that add a dimension so this should be 50 and this one should be aligned horizontal I could add a point let's take a look just in case I need it later on so I'll just put a point right there if not it's not white not really a problem now I want to extrude that and I want to intersect that extrude with the already existing solid okay so I want to go for an extruded cut if you wonder why you will see okay let's select the sketch that would be this one here I want to go for a mid plane distance maybe 150 millimeter and now I can flip the side to cut that's similar to the cut here version like that confirm and I've got my basic shape here now what's left to do another hole and a mirror now I need a plane so let's go for a plane and this plane should have an offset from the front plane maybe 30 millimeter and confirm okay maybe show that sketch here and I need the whole wizard and I need a counterboard one diameter should be 60 millimeter depth should be if I go through all that doesn't matter seaboard diameter is 30 millimeters and the seaboard depth should be 30 minus 17 that's 13 millimeter let's switch to the positions and I select that plane here and then here that origin point of that sketch let's confirm this and this looks okay now I want to mirror that feature maybe hide that sketch go for a mirror in this case I want to mirror this with the front plane and I want that hole here to be mirrored and confirm and I'm done so I hope this was helpful hope you liked it if you did like it please give it a like or leave a comment if you want to see more please give it a like or leave a comment please subscribe to my youtube channel that would really help you could follow me also on GrabCat, Facebook, Instagram and many more thanks for watching see you to the next one bye bye